So in this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Relusion Accurig 1.1. Now, I made a video about this four months ago, but they just did a sweet update on it that makes this tool right here compatible with Unreal Engine mannequins. And with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and just go to choose file, and I'm just going to load up a scanned uh, asset FBX of my body that I did recently. Um, so you can see right there, that's actually my body that I scanned. Um, and to be honest, this is how crazy this tool is. I'm just going to go right here at the bottom right corner. I'm just going to say rig body. Okay, so what I'll do right now is I'm going to click on symmetry and I'm just going to move this here a little bit. It's just off a little bit, but it's not too bad. It actually did a pretty darn good job as far as placing all these markers. I'll just move it right here. Uh, but overall, that did a pretty good job. So I'm just going to say rig right hand. This dude has five fingers and I was joking. This is not my real body. Okay. I mean, it could be, but it's not. All right, so let's look at the hand right here. I'm just gonna move this, and I'm actually using this as a guide right here. So I'm just gonna move it a little bit and make sure that thumb rotation is facing the correct way, just like so. Move it to the knuckles and just the nail. I mean, everything else looks pretty darn good. I mean, honestly, I'm just being very picky right now. Even if I don't do this, I'm pretty sure it's gonna work right. All right, so we have the wrist right here. That looks about right. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and say rig the other hand, and it's the same thing. It's just, this dude's got really long nails, so you don't have time to cut your nails when you go to the gym, bro. It's just not a thing. Move this here, and again, I'm just gonna move this around. Maybe you can quickly just do this here. Now for the wrist, I would say kind of move it up just so. And that looks pretty good. And let's click on finalize character. And this is going to calculate skin weights, which is insane. And just like that, that character is now freaking rigged. So I'm going to pause it right here. And let's do a test. Let's go with body. Let's do this exercise right here. Wow, look, look at that contact point right there. It's actually on point. And... Again, and I'm going to say this over and over again, we are so darn spoiled nowadays. For us to have this for free is insane, man. It is truly amazing to be alive right now. Um, this is crazy cool. So if you remember four months ago, I did this, and whenever we exported it to Unreal, it did not match the skeleton whatsoever. But now it looks like they fixed it. So I'm going to show you what I'm talking about real quick. So I'm going to go to the bottom right corner. I'm going to click on export. I'm going to click on export FBX. I'm going to select Unreal. Now you can use other softwares, obviously. But we're going to go with Unreal. And I'm just going to say export right here. And I'm just going to name this Dude Man. And I'll save that. Okay, so here we are in Unreal Engine 5.1 project that I have. This is an empty one. What I'm going to do is drag and drop that FBX we exported out of Accurig. And in here, for the actual skeleton, if I go up here, I can select UE4 Mannequin Skeleton now. And it's going to make sure everything else is good. And I click on Import. This is now going to attach that skeletal mesh to the UE4 Mannequin, which is good because by doing so, we just made this character compatible with all of the Unreal Engine 4 animations in the marketplace. Additionally, we can easily retarget from a UE4 mannequin to a UE5 mannequin using the Rig Retargeter. Again, before it did not work because the bone system coming out of Accurig had prefixes, but I went ahead and told Relusion that, and it looks like they got it fixed. So this is perfect. It works. If I go to Animation Assets, I can actually go to Jog, and now you're gonna see that that mannequin will now animate. All right, so what I'll do is I'll press play right now. You can actually see that animation is working with that skeletal mesh that we just rigged in like three freaking minutes. That's pretty insane, in my opinion. And again, it is 100% free. Well, that's pretty much it. That is how you use the Relusion Accurig to rig something for your Unreal Engine projects or NVIDIA Omniverse. Peace out.